What's up and good afternoon guys. Welcome back to another Red Fox Outdoors video. Today we've got something a little special in mind for you today. Uh, today we're going to be doing two bushcraft tarp tent type shelters. Excuse the traffic going by. Um, <laughs> can't help it guys. Anyway, like I said, today we're going to do two bushcraft tarp tent shelters for you. But before we do that, i got a little surprise for you. Uh, we had some new t-shirts made. And uh, so let me know if you guys would be interested in uh, purchasing a t-shirt. Uh, right now, currently, we have two. So let me uh, scroll the camera down just a little bit and show you what we got. So we have the black t-shirt with the white logo on the front, just like this here. And then we also have a OD green shirt with a black logo across the front. Uh, thinking about maybe making some hats. Um, we'll be doing maybe some stickers, um, some key tags or something like that. So let me know if you guys would be interested in uh, purchasing something like that. And if you are, then I'll get it up on the website for you guys to purchase. Uh, currently, the t-shirts that are available right now... Um, I don't have them up on the website yet, but um, the t-shirts that will be ready for purchase uh, are going to be a small, medium, large, extra large, and 2XL. Uh, the 2XL is the biggest that I can get it to go for right now, um, but we will be um, having those on uh, both in the black and white and the OD green and black. So. If you guys would be interested in something like that, let me know. Um, and we'll definitely get them up on the website for you guys to purchase. Again, we'll have t-shirts for now. Um, I can get some hats. I can get stickers. I can get key tags, whatever else with the uh, Red Fox Outdoors logo on it. So if you guys would be interested in something like that, let me know. But in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and get the uh, tarp shelter set up. Or get it ready to set up for you and I'll show you guys how to set up two bushcraft tarp tent type shelters so stay tuned and we'll be right back right after this okay guys we're back give me just a second to grab the tarp and we'll get it laid out and i'll show you how to set this thing up really quick really easy bushcraft style tarp tent so we'll be right back let me go grab the tarp and give me just a minute to get it all laid out all right so what i've got here is the el fuego hammocks three meter by three meter tarp it's in a coffee brown and what I'll do is in the description, I'll leave a link for it down in the description for you guys. So that way, if y'all want to purchase one, y'all can. Let's set the bag down right there. All right, let me go over here and lay this out. All right, as you can see, it's all laid out. Now, what we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and stake it out. Let me come over here real quick. All right, so as you can see... We got the corner here so we're not going to stake it down what we're going to do is we're going to come over here to this second tab right here not this one but that one there and then this one right here so we're going to stake both of those two little tabs down and we're going to leave that corner unstaked and then we're going to do the same thing we'll do that tab right there and that tab over there and then we'll leave that corner unstaked Over here, we'll do this tab over here. All right, 
Now then, what we're going to do is we're going to pull this corner tab right here over to where this tab is right here. We're not going to stake this tab down. We're just going to take this one here. We'll pull it over to about here and we'll stake it down right there. And then we'll pull this tab over here, bring it into this tab here, and we'll stake it down right there. We're not going to stake down any of these tabs here in the front. This one, this one, or that one there. We're going to leave all three of those unstaked. So we'll just we'll pull this tab over to about right here and stake it. And then we'll grab this tab over here and we'll pull it over to about here and we'll stake it there. And I'll show you that here in just a second. So let me go ahead and do that now. Alright, now we got the two corners pulled in, and what we're going to do is we're going to grab our, uh, our big pole right here that we've already cut. Um, so what you're going to have to do is either with a trekking pole or with a, um, uh, like if you're out in the woods or whatever, get you a, a pole about, I don't know, uh, maybe waist high maybe a little higher and then we'll place it out here about 12 to 18 inches back from the front here and it'll pull it up and make like a little tin out of it but before we do that um, I've got to put a piece of paracord here on the center and then I got to put a piece of paracord uh, I think it's on that tab there in the back and we'll pull that up and I'll show you here in just a second what we're going to do with that so let me get a piece of paracord and we'll uh, tie it onto that tab there and then give me just a second here we'll grab the pole we'll stand it up and I'll show you what we're going to do with that piece of paracord so that y'all can see what I'm doing here hopefully just going to square knot here so it's easy to undo all right so there's our tie out point all right Grab the second one over here. Okay, now we got everything tied out on it. Alright, so we got our pole. Now, what I'm going to do is with this pole, right here, just past that tab there, about 18 inches out on that tarp, I'm going to put it up inside the tarp, and I'm going to lift that tarp up, and this pole's got to go about 18 inches back, just a little bit past that little uh, tab there. So I'll set that up, and we'll get it, and you'll see what I mean by it looking almost like a tent. So. Let me go ahead and do that now. All right. All right so now you can see how it kind of starting to look like a tent, sort of, right? Hats here. We're going to pull them back over here, and we're going to tie them down into our stakes over here.
get our tab pulled out. Grab another steak. Good. And then we'll grab the front over here. And then we'll pull this front out. We'll stick it down over here. So there we go. And there is one bushcraft tarp style tent. Now go ahead and take you off the tripod here. I'll show you down the side here. All kinds of room. You got enough room here for two people to lay down in the uh, we can put one person here. And then one person over here. You got plenty of room for two people and all their gear in here. So there you go. Bushcraft style tarp tent. It's a three meter by three meter or nine by nine tarp tent. Pretty cool. All right, we're back, guys. Okay, so for this one here, we're gonna need three stakes. That's what we're gonna be using. Okay, so for this one, it's called the pyramid tent, and I'll show you why it's a pyramid tent here in a minute. It's more of a triangle, but anyway, it's going to be completely enclosed and you can get in and out of it pretty quickly. So what we're going to do is we're going to stake that back corner there. We're going to stake that back corner there and then we're going to leave everything else undone. And I'll show you why here in just a minute. All right. So what we're going to do is once we get those two staked down back there, we're going to take this corner here and this corner over here and we're going to bring both of these over here to the center so it makes this kind of triangular shape back here kind of like a triangle pyramid so let me get the the two back corners staked out and then i'll be right back So, as you can see, we have this sort of triangle shape like that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to grab the center of the tarp here. We're going to pull it up. And then we're going to find out how big of a pole that we need to put in here in the center. So let me do that now. And I'll show you what we're going to do next. about shoulder height okay so if it's a little bit longer than shoulder height that's fine but we need it about shoulder height so, again measure about shoulder height okay and then just take cut it off as you can see 
the edge of that is nice and beveled around the edge so that way we're not going to be poking through the tarp and poking holes in it. Right now, again, it's about shoulder height, and what we're going to do is we're going to take it and we're going to set it in the very center of it. So, give me a minute, I got to crawl inside and then stand it up. As you can see, it's fully enclosed, and you got this kind of pyramid-looking shape to it. Now, it's a little difficult to get in and out the door here on the front, but in a really high wind and a lot of rain or whatever, this will keep you super dry. In this doorway where it's folded here, what we're going to do is we'll take that doorway and we'll fold it over here to the side, and we can stake it down. I'll show you here in just a second. What you do is, because I've got it tied too tight, I'll take and tie a piece of paracord here, and then I bring it back, and I can tie it down over there to uh, one of the other um, one of the other little deals here where we can stake it down. So there's enough room in there for two people. So let me take you off the tripod. All right. Come over here, grab our door. All right, so we got one side there, got this side here, and then this side back here, back behind me. And I'm setting up in here completely upright, zero issues. And there's enough room in here for two people. You can lay one here and then one over here. So I can lay here and then someone else can lay right there. And then we got enough room for gear and stuff right here. And as you can see, all kind of crazy room in here. There you go. Pyramid style tarp tent. Bushcraft style. And then to give yourself some more room, you can take these little tabs, you pull them out a little bit, stick them down. Same thing over here. Alright guys, that's what I got for you today. Be right back. Okay guys, so there you go. Two bushcraft style tarp tent shelters for you to fix. Super easy, super simple, easy to set up. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give this a thumbs up. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and uh, hit the bell notification. And make sure to click on all notifications so that way you get a notification on when my videos get uploaded. So that's all I got for you today, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Have a great afternoon, and we'll see you right back here next time. Have a great day, guys. Till next time, get out and enjoy nature. Bye, guys.